it's just like it's a lot that goes into music that I feel the average person really doesn't understand or, or know about <laughs> Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. So today I wanted to do a video of me breaking down my lyrics. So I'm taking one of my songs and this song, the whole song is a bar. It sounds like a love song and first impression you would think that I was talking about somebody that I'm in a relationship with or you know, a boyfriend or husband or something like that, but I'm really talking about my love for music and my relationship with music. So here's the song. I'm just going to play uh, the first part of it and then I'm going to break down the bars. Oh yeah, leave down in the comment section if you can tell me what song this is on. It's crazy on the track. It's crazy cause I don't trust shit. But you one of the few I really fell in love with. From the very beginning, knew I had my mindset. Tough pill to swallow, just something I had to digest. It's crazy cause I don't trust shit. That's just, that's not really a bar. That's just me being real. I don't trust anything. And it's crazy cause I don't trust shit. But you one of the few I really fell in love with. Talking about my love for music. Um, I don't trust people in general. I don't trust, I can't trust boyfriends because they've all deceived me. But it was like when I started doing music from the very beginning, I was able to trust it. I've always been able to listen to music. Music has always been there for me when I didn't have anyone. From the very beginning, Knew I had my mindset. Tough pill to swallow, just something I had to digest. That's just real. That's just, from the very beginning I started doing music, I knew it's what I wanted to do. And it was a tough pill to swallow because a lot of people judged me. Um, a lot of people didn't understand why I chose to do music. So that was a tough pill to swallow, but I knew from the very beginning that this is what I want to do. I've known it all along. Heard a love before, guess I wasn't immune. First sound of your voice, you had me in tune. You was there. First sound of your voice, you had me in tune. That's the bar. In tune, music, first sound of your voice. And, and there again, it still sounds like a love song. Like, you know, you hear people talk about when they met their wife and just her first time I heard her say my name or something. It's just real. It's just, you know, you if you love something, you love their voice. And I was just turned into a bar, um, you know, tune because you tune music. Heard a love before, guess I wasn't immune. Sound of your voice, you had me in tune. You was there every trip when I'm making a move. Me and my daughter, by you were there every trip when I'm making a move. Every trip you go on when you're riding in the car, what are you doing? You're listening to music, but there again, sounding like a relationship because you know you go on trips together and you know you start dating and then you're inseparable, so you are going everywhere together and going places together. So another bar me and my daughter by the way she in love with you too me and my daughter by the way she in love with you too my daughter loves music and i love music i'm still feeling you without a touch at all we connect on so many levels see that sums it all mama i'm still feeling you without a touch at all we connect on so many levels see that sums it all it's not a physical relationship, is what I'm saying. Without a touch at all. Oh, mama didn't want to see us get involved. But we showed her that's a problem. 
problem we could all resolve mama didn't want to see us get involved you know you dated people that your parents hate and you was just like oh my god don't eat the blood don't eat the blood for me you end up you to the point where you want to leave your family to do this but you and the guy end up well the guy ends up proving himself to your mother um you know it's it happens and that was my situation with music too because my mom was a little confused at first that I wanted to do hip hop and the type the first song I ever dropped was called Don't Try Me and it was not a song that your mother would appreciate but you know it was a club song and I was being a savage and my mom didn't really connect with that song to say the least but that was the thing I I we me and the music proved to my mother that it could all be resolved I ended up dropping an album full of songs that anybody can listen to your mom your kids grandma grandpa no matter who you are male female somebody can relate to it so I really showed my mom that the music thing is not bad but <clears throat> and especially by the things I'm talking about in my music I'm not talking about the same things as these other female rappers. I'm talking about real shit. Real, relatable shit. You know, but I'm not just, just not talking about the same things. Um. Uh, we vibe different, it's a fact. So tell them beat it, cause when we together, it's a rap. My love. We vibe different, it's a fact. Music is vibes, obviously, but you also feel vibes when you're with your a significant other. So tell them beat it, cause when we together, it's a rap, it's a bar. Tell them beat it, I'm, all, I'm rapping on a beat, cause when we're together, the beat in me, it's a rap, I rap. See man, it just goes over people's heads like, that's what's the I think the most frustrating thing about where I'm at is I'm trying I'm trying to make everybody happy, you know, uh, with my music. I want I want people to like my music, but I know there's only a certain audience that's gonna like my music, and that audience is people that actually actually listen and people that appreciate bars and lyrics and wordplay. Okay, sounding, having a professional sound is only a little piece of it to me. So that's my thing, I'm all about lyrics. My love for you ain't no stopping that, nah, I really mean it and I promise. My love for you ain't no stopping that, meaning I love music and i'm gonna chase my dreams and nobody's gonna stop me from loving music just like if you love somebody if you truly love somebody nobody can stop you from loving them because your heart's set i really mean it and i promise you that that there is No heaven sent that I'm into you. You the one that I listen to when these times get miserable. You the one I listen to when these times get miserable. I listen to music when I'm miserable. Just like other people probably listen to their significant other when they're miserable. You need somebody to vent to. And music is there for me when I'm miserable. And music is always the one that I have turned to. When I don't have nobody else. See, true love for me is someone that's always going to be there for you. And someone that's never going to just leave you and desert you. And Let me stop. Everybody complicate what they don't understand. They stuck in the same routine, but we got different plans. Everybody complicate what they don't understand. 
they stuck in the same routine, but we got different plans. Everybody complicate wants to complicate relationships because they're not happy. Just like everybody wants to complicate the fact that I'm doing music. I'm not hurting anybody. Okay? I have no reason to stop doing music. It keeps me out of trouble. You know, I'm I love it. It makes me happy to create music. Whether or not anybody likes it at all, that's the thing. I'm an artist whether I have zero fans or a million fans, I'm still an artist. I still love to create. This is still what I do. Whether or not people appreciate me and my music, whether or not people appreciate you and your girlfriend or people appreciate you and your boyfriend, y'all love one another and y'all are going to be together. For plans. Yeah, we on the same team, but I'm still a fan. Take us to pop and catch and smoke like second hand. Yeah, we on the same team, but I'm still a fan. Yeah, we on the same team. Yeah, I do music, but I'm still a fan of music. I still listen to other people's music. Um, take us apart, they catch and smoke like second hand. Oh my gosh. Bars. Take me and music apart. And I'ma shoot you. Smoke. Like secondhand. Like secondhand smoke. That's what you gonna you gonna get shot. Okay? Just like if somebody tries to come in between you and your boo, you gonna kill them. You gonna beat their ass. You don't like nothing is going to complicate your relationship. Nothing's gonna take you away from one another. Nothing is gonna take me away from music. It doesn't matter. Nothing matters. What people think, it does not matter. Okay, whether or not people listen to my music, it does not matter. Whether or not people are watching this YouTube video right now, it does not matter because I'm doing what I love. Just like relationships. You you're with somebody that you love, it does not matter what other people think of that or whether or not, you know, anybody cares like you just want to be happy and that person makes you happy just like music makes me happy i just want to be with my music that's all i want like i could we have our ins and outs but always seem to make amends we have our ins and outs but always seem to make amends you would think relationship right we have our ins and outs ups and downs but we always make up me and music, that's a bar because when, when I'm doing my music, I always do, when I do my verse, that is my lead verse. And then I go in and I do ins and outs on my verse. Literally, like we have our ins and outs. Like I have my ins and outs on my recordings on the beat. But I always seem to make amends and it brings it all together. It's the ongoing bond, I bet it never ends. Regardless how it plays out, we'll be forever friends. But his Regardless how it plays out, we'll be forever friends. You gotta press play in order to hear the music. And um, no matter what happens, no matter if I become a mainstream artist or not, I'm still gonna have music. I'm still gonna love music. I'm still gonna listen to music. I'm still gonna make music. It's just my relationship with music. That's my friend. Ever friends, but history repeats itself, so we'll be back again. They don't like that we together, I just let them hate. But they don't know I'm getting closer to you every day. They don't like that we together, I just let them hate. They don't like that you and your girlfriend are together, so you just let them hate. They don't like that you and your boyfriend or you and your husband are getting married, but y'all just let them hate. But what they don't know. They in your ear telling you, he's not good for you. She's not good for you. You're never going to make it in music. But they don't know. Y'all y'all two are getting closer every day. She tells you everything. You tell her everything. You know, I'm getting closer to my dreams every single day. Every single day that I even just sit at home and 
watch YouTube tutorials about how to start a vlog or mindset, motivate, watch motivational speeches, or watch tutorials on how to record my own songs. I'm getting closer every single day. Whether or not I have the best marketing team right now, whether or not I'm reaching a million people, I'm still getting closer. I'm still another subscriber in. You know, every time I get a view, I'm happy and I'm appreciative. And, you know, I just hear a lot of people complaining. But why are you complaining? Stop complaining and be grateful. Anyways, y'all see where I'm getting at with this. Let me, let me start blabbing on about stuff, but... Uh, yeah, so I just wanted to break down that song for you, break down the bars, because a lot of you don't understand that I'm actually speaking facts. All facts, no cap, okay? But yeah, I just wanted to break down some of my bars for y'all, and so that maybe more people start catching on, you know, more people that are um that appreciate music that has lyric uh wordplay in it and appreciate bars and appreciate stuff like that the same stuff i appreciate maybe they maybe y'all can find me if i start doing vlogs about it so explain oh yeah i forgot to mention to you guys i'm going to be leaving the link to my mixtape in the description box below if you are interested in hearing this song and my other mixtape songs, just click the link and follow me on my mixtapes. Thanks. YouTube, yeah, I'll definitely respond to your comments. And the best way to get in touch with me is to comment under my videos because I really appreciate that. When you do, please subscribe. Please click the bell so that you can get notifications when I post videos.